Alrighty guys, welcome back to another mail time. We have five packages today that we're gonna get through and we do still have spillover. So there's gonna be another mail time coming up uh, next week is the goal. Uh, but yeah, five today, multiple countries again, really, really cool. So uh, thank you guys in advance. We have my dad right here. Hello. Um, of course me and uh, my wife behind the camera. Some Hello. other family here, so it's gonna be a fun time. Let's get into it. Alrighty guys, so we're gonna start out with these envelopes first. Um, we'll start out with the white one. This is from Jason in New South Wales, Australia. Jason, thank you, let's see what we got. We got a letter, huh? Oh my God. All right, we got the good old Tim Tams. I can't mistake those packages. To Ian I.W. Rocker. All right, Bill, um, very nice letter. Uh, he provided his email, I will email you. Um, that'll be easier to get a hold of you. So yes, thank you for that. We do have Tim Tams. We have Double Coat and, ooh, and Chewy Caramel. Yay! So uh, they arrived in good order. I do appreciate it, thank you. Thank you. All right, and next up, we have this envelope from Andrew in Victoria, Australia. <laughs> yeah, nice name. All right, so we have, let's see what we got here. Cool. Okay. So we have some sort of a book here, but I'm gonna look at that in a second. All right. Oh, this is Andrew, otherwise known as Top 40 Researcher in the comments, yes. Hello. I see you all the time, hello, hello. Dear Ian and family, gre greetings from Wodonga on the Murray River in New South Wales in a Victoria border, Whoa. the longest river in Australia. The river is 2,508 kilometers Damn. or 15,000 or 1,500 rather uh, miles. I am only five and a half hours from the city of Sydney and just over three hours from Melbourne. The population of Wodonga is 42,000, 97,000 across Albury, Wodonga. As you may notice, I am on the border of two states the Albury population is 53,000. I regularly travel to Albury. <laughs> Sydney. <laughs> That's Sydney? Oh my goodness. That's Sydney, guys. She heard, she heard her name in there, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's excited. Um, I regularly travel to Albury by public transport, by bus. The train services are very limited between Albury and Melbourne. Uh, there are only three services a day. That is not including the XPT. <laughs> The express passenger train. Uh, Melbourne to Sydney and vice versa. Overnight service with the letter. I've included a book called The Murray River Access that includes the towns of Barma, Achuka, Moama, and Torumbari, where I couldn't get a hold of the Albury and Wodonga edition as it wasn't available, but it will give you some idea of what our towns are like and some of them historic and haven't changed over the past 150 years. That's really cool. Um, I have said that on my videos that it's obviously really fun to see uh, any, you know, books or videos or anything on, on towns. Because everyone knows like Melbourne and Sydney, of course, but it's really fun to see smaller towns and interesting places in other countries, right? Not just the big cities. Yeah. So uh, I appreciate that. That's really cool. Uh, I live in a two bedroom unit slash apartment. You can see that looks like a house. There's four on the block and all of them are two bedrooms. I'm only 90 minutes drive from the Falls Creek Ski Resort. And yes, it does get cold here. In summer, it can get as high as 42 C or 107 Fahrenheit. Woo. Wow. But it can get as low as 26 Fahrenheit overnight in winter. During the day, it might be around 13 C or 55 degrees Fahrenheit. I would like to extend my sincere gratitude that you have given not only Australia, but all Australians, your reactions into places in Australia. I hope one day it will be our lifelong dream to come to this beautiful country of ours and experience what our lucky country has to offer. All the best to the family. Stay safe. Andrew, thank you. That is really awesome. Yes, that is our dream. It, it, it will happen as soon as we can do that. And uh, I think it's going to be epic for sure. I, I really love the community we have on the channel. I do appreciate it. Uh, I won't show this, but um, he has a picture of his unit. And that is interesting. That's not what I would have thought. So it's it's pretty cool to see. All right, and then here is that booklet on uh, showing some of the uh, the little towns, the points of interest, the transport, all that kind of thing. This is Murray River Access. Murray River. 
with the uh, towns in question. Wow, that's cool. cool. You have all your emergency phone numbers. Wow. Of course, the phone numbers are different, right? It's so weird. Like the hospital in Barma, 5485-5000. So it's just eight digits. You see that? Yeah, that's weird. Four and four. Yeah. And it's always interesting to see because it's just different from Oh, well, the emergency here. phone was kind of like 911. What is it, like 800? Oh, where's that? At the top. Oh, yeah. It's still like 911 here in the U.S. Isn't 911... I feel like 911, I, I thought it... We talked about that in a video one time. I think 911 they do use in certain countries, right? Other no. countries? Or no? Maybe Mexico? Maybe not. You guys tell me if you know that. Yeah, 911 is famous, like, universal emergency all across North America, at least. Mm. You know, because I know Canada uses 911. Really? I think so. So does the, obviously the U.S. does. I don't know. Mexico probably doesn't. Think, doesn't Mexico use it or no? I think so, maybe. Anyway, yeah, very interesting, the different numbers, even the emergency numbers. And yeah, I mean, look, it's cool. We got some maps. This is literally on the border because, yeah, New South Wales and Victoria... I mean, they're right there, separated. It's cool. It's always interesting. I mean, I, we can relate to this because, like, we've literally lived in two different places, and both places we've lived were on a border of two different states. Yeah. <laughs> we lived on the border of New Mexico and Texas, and yeah. we've been on the border of Illinois, Wisconsin, like, my whole life. So, but, you're right? So yeah. we can relate to that. But is this river the border for the two states, or no? That's what I was trying to tell. It's like Illinois, the border on the west side is the Mississippi River. Yeah, the, the whole outline of Illinois, the western outline, that yeah. shape is just the Mississippi River. Yeah, I, didn't, Mississippi. I never knew that. You know? I never knew that. All even the south. Even the bottom part is the, the bottom part is the Ohio River. Yeah, the bottom yeah. part is the Ohio River. So yeah. a lot of, you know, two-thirds of Illinois' border is just rivers. Yeah. Then the other ones are artificially straight. Who would have known? And Lake. <laughs> and then the lake is lake part Michigan of it. Yeah. Wow. Top, yeah. So yeah, it just depends. Um, that could be the case here. I'm not really sure. Mary there's a Mary Oh, I'm sure there is. It's somebody in the comments. A very, very there. famous place there. I'm they sure there's a was, and there is. I'm, there is a. Uh, what the hell is it? So I can't think of. Oh my gosh! This is freaking <laughs> a Welton territory. Is that wild? A <laughs> what? Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. The oh, name yeah. of that territory. With the Welton without the H. <gasps> Ding, 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 ding. Look, 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 Ian has a place in Australia ding, 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 near the yeah. Murray River. Alrighty, and next up we have this big heavy box. This is from Luke, of course, in Australia. Luke, Luke is awesome. Luke. Uh, yeah, he's sent some amazing stuff before. So thankful that we're still getting another amazing package from you. Luke, you rock. Thank you, Luke. All right, so we do have a letter to Ian, Daniela, and family. Been a little time since I've sent you a parcel. Just thought I would send you some more. I put some Vegemite that will probably puzzle you and your family. Ooh, okay. <laughs> put this together, just working out what would be unusual. What? Check out a movie with comedian Jim something. It's called uh, The Crack for a Good Laugh. While well, hoping your family are in good spirits, time to dig in and see from Luke. P.S. Just before I go, just to let people know this is the way to pack your parcels so things won't get damaged. Use the other packing material like newspaper, scrunch it up into balls and stop pressing from other parcels or, stop, or shopping bags. Just a hint to save your parcel from your mate, Luke. That's awesome. There you go. You Thank heard it from you, Luke. Luke. Yeah. Some tips. <laughs> it's got styrofoam there. Let's see. Oh, yeah, let's look see. at this. This is very well done. Yeah. Okay, got okay. the styrofoam on top. We got the bags crunched up. We got uh, more styrofoam. Oh yeah, this is this is very well protected, it's right? Styrofoam on each side, huh? Uh huh. All right, let's do it. We have. Oh, this is cool. What's that? Look at this, apron, pot holder, and kitchen mittens all in one. What? Look at that, that's beautiful. Look! That is so yes. cool, dude. Thank you, Luke. I love it. Oh my gosh, it's yeah. so beautiful. I love that color scheme. Yes. I love it, thank you, Luke. It's for me, haha. <laughs> that is so cool. It's for Danny, huh? She's climbing it. Yeah. <laughs> very, very neat. I'm the neat. cook here. <laughs> nice. That's not all. What? You got another one. Are you we got Aussie lingo. Yeah. I love it. That's for me. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Is uh, yeah. 
Awker is a real Aussie. So I rocker is a real Aussie. Uh, <laughs> New That's <laughs> awesome. Yonks. It's been Yonks since I've seen you. That's, a, uh, that's, that's hilarious. Yeah. It's cool. It's so cute. That's probably steep. <laughs> Very cool. Oh, and look at this. This is nice. Look at this big bag. Okay, that is so cute. Very cool, right? Yeah, it's got little, little animals. Wow. It's like a little like map. It's so deep. That's nice, yeah. huh? Yes. Thank you, Luke. Very that is cool, beautiful. Luke. Thank you. Oh. Oh, and we got a uh, stubby holder to match. I love the red because you know that red's, is my, red's my favorite color. So that's very color. cool. Yeah, that's sure. We got a Coles bag. Ooh, just take a look. We got tons, tons of good ones. Ooh, look at they even have Coles. they even have buenos down there. Hell yeah! What? Instant? I love okay, these. Okay, these are oh so good. good. Can, they're like can, little mini bueno chocolate. The chocolate mocks. Yeah, they're yeah, good. They're, they're like crunchy. Oh, German chocolate. Wow. That's delicious. Look at these ginger beers. That's cool. Are these different? Caramel and koala. Yummy. Those are classic. Kids love those. Mm. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Luke. Yeah, yeah the kids love the koalas. Oh, oh yeah. We even have some <gasps> genuine What's Cadbury that? cream eggs. Right? Are you serious? Remember, their Cadbury is different than ours. Oh, my gosh. Thank you, Luke. Is it Easter? Cool? No, it's oh, just they're just like caramel and koala. Isn't that cool? Oh, yeah. I was here. Oh, the kids nice. love those. Thank you, Luke. Yeah, Holy moly. <gasps> that's, that's awesome. Cool. Oh, dude. What, babe? That's so cool, Luke. Luke. What is it? What? What is it? Is it a car or something? We have a freaking ute. A ute? Oh, look at nice. that. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, Look at that. Oh huh? my gosh, that's so cool. That's a, it's an XY Falcon U. You don't have one, do you? No, not like that. Nice. Is that cool? Yeah. Look at that, from Australia. That's a U, it's like a car truck. <laughs> it's a car truck. Right? It's a, it's a Ford Falcon U. That's sure. That's neat. Nice. I know when I did a cool video on Australian muscle cars lately, right? People were saying, that I should really look for a Ford Ranchero in the U.S. Uh-huh. Because that was actually literally like the same as the Ford Falcon Ute of whatever years, you know, like late 60s. Yeah. It's like very similar. That'd be like the closest I could get to a wow. Australian Ute, you know? Yeah. Of course, we had the El Camino too, but... Oh, yeah, Camino. I like Ford those. Ranchero would look the part a little more, you know? Yeah, that's a nice car. Sorry, a Ute. 81. 81, isn't that crazy? Yeah. Beautiful. That's very nice die cast. Thank you, Luke. That's Thank awesome. you, Luke. Yeah, that's an awesome one. <laughs> Alright, so oh, oh, careful. we have a shoe box. Shoe, <laughs> we got some shoes, yeah. But I don't think there's shoes in there. I think we I think we got a lot more in there. Alright, let's see what's in the shoe box. Alright. Shoes. <gasps> oh. That is not shoes oh, in. No, I don't think we've shoes. gotten orange arrows before. Ooh, dang. Whoa. We have a massive try video, huh? Yeah. Coming up. Look at that, that's yeah. cool. Wow. Of course we have the best Kit Kats ever made. Nice. The Milo's. Ooh, yo, yes. The Milo Kit Kats. Oh yeah, the Milo's. Hmm. And uh, the Cheesecake Shop. Daryl Lee Caramel Cheesecake. Ooh, that sounds what? delicious. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Whoa. Dang, huh? Thank you, Lou. And we got Daryl Lee Rum and Raisin Dark Chocolate. I, I think I'm gonna like that one. Ooh, that's different. Oh, Rum and Raisin? Look at that. Look at that. Where's the cheesecake? Right here. <laughs> cheesecake. Cheesecake chocolate. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. I think I'm really going to like the rum and raisin a lot. <laughs> it's like it was real cheesecake. Yeah, yeah right? <laughs> so that's very nice. Great selection. Thank you, Luke. Oh, what is this? <laughs> cool, huh? Oh, it's so cute. What Thank you. It's a little bunny. Uh, oh, like a chocolate bunny? Oh, it's a Cadbury one. Yeah, it's oh, so cool. cute. The chunky Milo. Oh yeah, like very nice. cool. Crispy. We have a a bunny that didn't make it. No, <laughs> oh, he's broken. Oh yeah, Luke. What? Nice <gasps> job, dude. For the baby. We got paw paw ointment. Yes. That stuff's good. Yeah, for, especially like, for summertime. Everything. Insect bites and all that stuff. It? That stuff's good for everything: bites, burns, like rashes, mm -hmm. anything. 
Pump pimples. Pimples? Um, pimples? Ac yeah. Thank you, Luke. And we even got mini Milo K cats. For the kids. Very cool. Oh my gosh, you're so awesome, Luke. Oh, this is nice. This is really nice. We have a compact mirror, Melbourne edition there. Wow, that is That's beautiful. Cool, huh? Yes. Very neat. Oh, Thank you, Lou. It's beautiful. Ooh, I love bottle openers. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Whoa. And it's like a uh, magnet, too. Trousers. Oh, cool. Lest we forget the hands axe. Like oh, wow, it's pin. beautiful. Aww. Okay. Aww. Very cool. Thank you, Lou. And we also have uh, along that same line, look at, we have a bracelet as well. Wow. That's very nice too. It's all engraved. Yeah, it has little buttons. Wow, very, it's very, really very fancy. neat. Thank you. Yeah, that's what we forgot. For ends up there. Alrighty, and then we have, what is this? Oh, like a pen, like a pencil box, right? Ooh, like a ruler for school. Well, it's like a box that slides open. I think it's the pencil box. Oh, you store your, okay. you know? Oh, right? Yeah, it looks like it. Maybe if you open it, you'll find out what it is. I don't know. It says pencil box on the bottom. Okay, and then we have, these are some of my favorite, although these are different to the ones I have. Uh, these are the boomerang magnets. These are super cool, right? Oh, wow, yeah, those are cool. I love these. I display these on like everywhere. On your fridge. Right? On the fridges, my freezer. It's really, really cool. Thank yes. you. I can share some of those here a lot. Nice. And then what is this? This is cool. What? Welcome to the Grove. Love where you live. What? Whoa, look at this stuff. What's it's the a, room? It's like a um, booklet for like a builder, like a home builder. Oh. Oh. Thank you, you Luke. That? I am looking for a new house, so I will probably yes. buy a house in Australia. Yeah. Australia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah have right? choices. Oh, that's cool. Then Luke is like, come on, Look at guys. all the different. Um, oh my so God, that's sharp, dude. That's different. Let me than see. Here. It's very modern, huh? Very modern. I love it. Look at that. Wow. That's... Look at all the different lamps you can choose. Wow, that's beautiful. The different. The Holy moly! The I want all of those. That's cool, right? Yeah, that's really modern and beautiful. Holy crap! Right? I don't know. Look that up. Two hundred thirty-five oh, yeah. meters squared and square feet. Look at these are the two stories. You see oh that? Oh my gosh, they're pretty. That's cool, right? Like a little bit lower there. Whoa. Oh, I'm showing you. Yeah, it's like cute. Isn't that cool? Yeah, I want the. This one. is really cool. I appreciate that, Luke. I, I love looking at stuff like this. Oh man, that is cool. Oh, oh see that's that's actually good. 2,500 square feet. That's big. Alrighty, and then what do we got here? Well, I'll do the, this will be last. Hold on, we have, oh, this uh, is with the Anzac stuff. This is a, um, wow, really cool pen. Anzacappeal.com.au, right there. Very cool. Wow. Very nice pen, so thank, thank you, you. And then, <laughs> We have Vegemite, tastes like Australia. What? What is that? Oh, it's literally, oh my God. What is that? What is he he got me. I, I thought ha, ha. when he said, um, you know, it's I got something that'll puzzle you, you know? <laughs> I thought it was giving like a weird flavor of Vegemite. Nope, oh. it's literally a Vegemite puzzle. That's so cool. <laughs> okay, that's, that's gonna be cool. hard, it's all yellow. Cause like this side, it doesn't <laughs> show, you know? Oh, well, that's my. unique. You never had a Vegemite puzzle before. That's either. pretty cool. I appreciate that. Thank you, Luke. <laughs> that will be hard though with all the yellow. It will. Puzzle, yeah. Yeah. Alrighty, Luke. As always, excellent stuff. Thank you so much, man. Thank appreciate you so much, it. Luke. Thank you. Luke. Thank Thank you. Luke. Alrighty, and then we have this big yellow box, and this is from Ian in the United Kingdom. Oh, Ian, yeah. awesome oh, name. Hi, Ian. Cool name. Right, I know yeah, Ian right nice. here. <laughs> Great name, uh, Ian from the UK. Thank you so much. Really cool yellow box. Let's see what's inside. Is it right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm excited. What do we got here, huh? I don't know. What is it? <gasps> oh. oh, yeah, dude. Oh, dude Whoa. Whoa. Holy smokes. That's, that's a real plate, huh? Whoa. Those are real. Yeah. Feel that? They're metal, huh? Oh, that is so cool. We got a yellow and a white one. Is the e EU logo on it. The flag. Yeah, that's right. And you know what? I just remembered the UK is kind of cool for the plates. You know why? Why? They're one of the only countries. They have a different colored plate for the front and the back of the car. That's crazy. Really? I, I don't remember which one's which, but like, 
you know, the yellow goes on one end and uh -huh. then white goes on the other. Mm -hmm. Which Ooh. most countries don't do that, right? Right. That's pretty cool, huh? They do that always for every car? I think they do that in the UK for most cars on the road, yeah. That's weird. Isn't that cool, guys? Yeah. yeah. Wow, they're so, they're so big. They're so, Be like, careful. wide, right? Compared to our plates. Yeah. They're very, um, it's just, it's, just like it's weird to hold one in person, you know? Wow. They're also bigger than the um, Australian plates. Yeah. Because Australian plates were wider than ours, mm -hmm. but nowhere near as this big, that's, you know? Yeah, that's long. So how do they attach these? Is it like a screws, like with theirs? Honestly, that's magnet. a good question because I don't see like little right. screw holes. I don't see little screw they holes. They probably slide it in somewhere. I bet it either slides in yeah. or slide some it. somehow has is modified with like a magnet. Kind of a bracket or something. Or yeah. bracket. You guys yeah. let us know how these are attached typically. Ours mm -hmm. have holes in four holes. Yeah, ours have pre-drilled holes in the plate. Every state too, right? Every state does that. Same thing. Yeah. Same, same thing, yeah. Yeah. So that's different. Um, very, very cool though, Ian. I really do Thank appreciate you, Ian. it. I love anything cars, anything license plates. That is super cool. I do appreciate that a lot. Same Thank number, you. Huh? Oh, oh my, my god. god. What That's do we so got cool. here? I like stickers. Oh, this is like tags for the cars, yeah? There. Okay. Let's see what we got. I think. So let's just look at the letter. We do have a letter. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ian, I enjoy your channel. Looking at cars, trucks, emergency vehicles, and rallying around the world. <laughs> Heck yeah. I thought you would like some UK car number plates to add to your wall. Initially, UK number plates were white or silver letters on a black background. Cool. That's pretty cool. The silver and black sounds cool. Yeah. After 1968, reflex reflective plates started appearing as an extra safety feature. After 1973, all new cars had these. These carry black lettering on a white reflective black background for the front and yellow for the rear. Yellow for wow. the rear. That's really cool, right? Yeah, okay. that's neat. The blue Euro symbol with country designation GB used to be required for driving around the rest of Europe, but is no longer valid since Brexit. That's right. Wow. Because now the UK isn't in the EU, right? Okay. It's part of Europe, the continent. Yeah. But it's not in the e. so that's it's not like, in the European Union anymore. I just noticed it is reflective, see? It is reflective, the, yep. Paper up it's not plain white. It yeah, is reflective, reflective. yeah. But this one is not. Yeah, because this one's for the rear. Yeah, isn't that weird? Yeah, so this they probably don't want that flashing in your face when your yeah. headlights are on it, you know? But in, in, in Illinois, at least, both of ours are reflective. Yeah. Front and back. Yes. That's right. So our plates are the same. If, if it's a state that requires front and rear, it's the same, yeah. You don't get any like different types for the front. So I think that's pretty cool. I, I think that's very unique. A separate UK roundel now needs to be displayed on the rear of the car instead, or new number plates with UK and the union flag shown on the blue panel must be acquired. Okay, so these are the EU era plates, and the newer plates must have UK here, and it has the Union Jack flag then. That's what it sounds the like. The new one? The new ones oh. after Brexit. Oh, okay. this? Whereas this would have been, you know, car, a car that was registered before that. Pre-Brexit? -pre Pre-Brexit. Pure EVs have started displaying a green panel in place of the blue Euro panel. Wow. So if it was an EV, this would be green then. That's okay. Cool. I, I like this breakdown. You're speaking Thank my you, language, Ian. Ian. Thank oh, you. Oh, Ian's getting along, I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Ian's think alike, right? This is very interesting. The letters and numbers have special meanings which have changed over the years, as has the format. Currently, the first two letters denote the region where the vehicle was initially registered. DL denotes Shrewsbury. The two-digit number identifies a six-month period when a vehicle was initially registered. 68 denotes September 2018 to February 2019. March 2018 to August 2018 would have been denoted by the digit 1-8. The remaining three letters are just a unique sequence and cannot include the letters I or Q. Combinations that could appear offensive in English or foreign languages are also excluded. <laughs> Once allocated a registration number, it is usually kept for the life of the car. Unlike in Germany, where new numbers are, alloc are allocated every time it changes ownership or if the owner moves to another area. That would be more like our style. Mm -hmm. yeah. Car car plates definitely don't last the life of a car here, un unless someone goes out of the way. Yeah. I've seen people with really old like plates that they just kept going, but that's rare. Like me, I have ran through plates, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, 
that's very not common to have a car with 20 year old plates you know what i mean yeah yeah usually it just they change hands and plates change you yeah, know you, you always get new plates you get different plates every time you get a new car exactly whatever yep yeah so uh that's interesting the difference there between countries uh, when towing trailers in the UK, the trailer will display the same number as the towing car or truck. Okay. Really? In Germany, each trailer has its own unique number plate. So Germany is a little more like the US in that regard then. Because mm -hmm. also when towing here, your trailer or your camper or whatever has its own plate different from the actual truck or car that's towing it. Right? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, very interesting that. Um, Ian, I appreciate it. Uh, you left your hotmail, so we'll have to get a hold of you sometime. Uh, this is really cool. I, I can't thank you enough. Seriously. Thank you so and much. There Ian. is that um, sticker where if they're running the old EU plates, they have to have this on their car now. So it's like a temporary? Well, this is if they're running the pre Brexit plates, mm -hmm. then they have to run this on the car. Oh, well, okay. You know, because this is no longer valid because they're not part of the EU. Wow. You know? Mm -hmm. So very interesting. Uh, thank you so much for that. Thank awesome. you, Ian. Awesome yeah, stuff, Ian. Thank you. Great name, too. Good explanation. Yes. Yeah, thank you for the letter. All right, y'all, and this is the last box. This is a big one. It's heavy as well. I'm going to stand up for this one. Uh, this is from the great Roxanne, who has sent stuff before from Australia, of course. Roxanne, thank you so much. You are a legend. Thank you, Roxanne. I know this is going to be good. Trust me. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank uh, you. Let's see, all right? Whoa. All right, so, first of all, we got the Perth now. Uh, it's cool to get stuff from Perth, right? Because it's so different. It's way out there, isolated on the west coast of Australia. Mm -hmm. Way far away from the other big cities. Very cool. I, I, I A nightmare enjoy looking at that. We have more of these amazing bags <gasps> that we do have to use everywhere, yes. by the way. And we so, do. Very cool. I like this one, right? Smile. Aww. Oh, okay. Thank you, Roxanne. You're so sweet. Of course, the Coles ones. Oh, and we have festive Coles ones. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's, it's like an so Easter cool. one. Easter. Oh, look. Winnie the Pooh. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool. Oh, I like this one a lot. Wow. Look at that. It's avocados and fruits and look yummy stuff. Up. Aww. Really Thank you, Roxanne. What is this? I've never heard of these Tim Tams. They're like baby blue. They're baby blue, the package. What is that? Maybe like cotton candy? I don't know. You gotta make sure you get the right I wonder oh, what they I'm are. I'm excited to get new Tim Tams. <laughs> Whoa, that's a pretty Whoa, color. Whoa, this is so cool. Coconut, coconut cream. cream. Oh, I love coconut. I've never heard of those. <gasps> that is cool. Oh, boy. Mm. Wow. Yeah. You know, Thank I'm usually, you, I'm usually not a big coconut fan, but they made the package so cool looking. I might have to try it, right? Oh, okay, okay. You want to try them? Yeah, I love coconut. Yeah. Yeah. We'll try them right now before we. I usually I wait till the end. I'm going to try it right now. Can't resist. And I'm guys. saving the wrapper. Like, keep oh, it yes. Nice. We'll save the wrapper. Just, then you give it to me because you, you try one first then, and then I'll try one later. Oh, this is so cool. Is that a new flavor? I don't know. New, new for us. Damn, it smells good. Smell that. Oh my gosh. Smell that, dude. Yeah, because the coconut. Yeah. I, don't, I don't like coconut. Oh my gosh, Sean. How's it taste? I'll sniff it, but I won't eat it. Damn. Yeah. Oh my god. I'll eat all have one. Why is that astounding? Because coconut is all amazing. Ian, duh. That is freaking good. I, I usually don't like coconut. Well, all your kids do. They do? Oh my yeah. god. <laughs> He's having a Are those the best Tim Tams I've ever had? Oh my gosh, coconut, you just say you don't like it that much. Oh, thank you, Roxanne. Well, you've never had that flavor before. Uh -uh. No. I'm, I'm serious. Okay, I need to try one in the camera. I feel like this might be the best Tim Tam I've ever had. Okay. Alright, go for it. Try this. <laughs> Okay, let Emma go first. Take your time. What do you think? It's delicious, you guys. Right? It's not as sweet. It's just perfect. I love it. It's not as sweet as the other ones. It's actually really good. Was it just like the mom's candy bar? The coconut one or no? I don't know because I haven't had those before. I usually I usually stay away from coconut, but I freaking love this. 
Yeah, it's crunchy and light. Mm -hmm. I'm not a coconut fan. Damn. 10 out of 10, Roxanne. Thank you. 10 out of 10, Roxanne. Thank you. Yeah, I Thank guess you, we Roxanne. I guess we love coconut Tim Tams. Who knew, right? Mm -hmm. Very exciting. <laughs> Sydney, what's up, baby? <laughs> Alrighty, let's just dig in. We have a bunch of stuff in here, guys. I uh, I can't believe it. I'm so excited and very thankful, Roxanne. Yes, very thankful. Thank you, Roxanne. So first we have some movies. This is the complete Skippy, the Bush Kangaroo collection, all 91 episodes. Look at that. Aw, it's like a show. It's a kid show, isn't that cool? Thank <laughs> you. Very neat. Oh my God. You're gonna love it. They're into the age of like little shows and movies. Yes. So thank you, Roxanne. Thank you, Roxanne. Yes. I'm just Beautiful. gonna rip into these because there's a lot in here, guys. I'm so excited. What is that? Oh, this is for the kids. Oh, that's for the kids. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Are you... St <gasps> baking? Oh like my baking goodness. Thing? Emma and yeah. Andrew, look, because they like Emma, to make look. cooking videos. Okay, say thank you, Roxanne. Three, two, one, go. Thank you, Roxanne. Thank you, Roxanne. All right, guys. Oh, so cute. <laughs> you guys are so lucky. Yeah. You stay here, we're gonna open the stuff, all right? You might have more. Let's see, I think this might be for Emma and Andrew. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nice, bud. Look. Whoa. We got a Homestead starter pack. What? What is that? Look at that. It's like a Legos. Oh, like a Lego, yeah. You see that? Whoa. How cool is that, huh? That's amazing. That's really neat. Oh, thank you, Roxanne. Right. Roxanne, you're amazing. Thank you so yes, much. You. Okay. This. Oh, this is for me. <laughs> oh my Got an Australian beautiful. mug. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Wow. Nice. I like the sound of the box. The, uh, I love the box. The even, dream. Yeah. The flag is the oh, yeah. yeah right. That's beautiful. That's cool. Nice. Wow, that's fancy. That's cool, huh? That's a nice blue dark color. Very nice. How many stars on that flag? Six. Oh, you knew that without yeah. even looking, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, I knew that without looking. Okay, we got this is for Andrew oh, and Emma and oh, Emma. Say thank you. What are these, babe? It's like little wallets. It looks yeah. like or little pouches. I don't know. They didn't tell me. Here, let's see. Oh, it's a foldable shopping bag. Oh, that's what it is. Shopping. Okay, gotcha. You're so kids. yeah, now it makes sense. Okay, so the pink for Emma Aww. and the red for Andrew. All right. What do you guys say? Thank you. All right, guys. We got a Kohl's magazine. Thank you. That's for Damn, me. that looks good. I'm hungry. <laughs> he wants me to make him this now. Right. And they have the beets. Mm. Thank you so much. I love these books. All righty. And then in here. What's that? Wow. What's that, Ian? <gasps> so, okay. first of all, look, get a look at that bag. Wow. Look at the colors. Very cool, right? Colors, yeah. Wow. I love the colors, like sunset colors. <laughs> Isn't that cool, buddy? Wow. Thank you so much, Roxanne. Those are beautiful bags. Wow. And then, oh my goodness. Ooh, wow. <gasps> thank you. That's thank beautiful. You. Oh my. That's going to be cool. Gosh. Huh? Thank you, Roxanne. It's beautiful. Oh, You're going to look sharp. You got a cool shirt like me now. Yeah. Oh my I, have, gosh. I have some of these, huh? Yeah, yeah uh, you do. Wear them out dancing. You know? Yeah. I love that color. It's like burnt orange. I love it. Yeah, it's like a burnt orange, dude. Wow, that is That's beautiful. Like your, uh, old charger. Wow, thank you. Yeah. That is beautiful, Roxanne. I do like that. That is epic. Yeah, very, very pretty. I'm gonna try it on later. Wow. Oh my goodness, Roxanne. Thank you. It's a Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Roxanne. I love it. Alrighty, and then this is also in there. Oh my god. <gasps> That's a mug. It's the same pattern. It it's, matches the purse. It's a porcelain mug and coaster set. Wow. Very, very cool. <gasps> From Australian indigenous artist Jesse Sutton. There wow. it is. Very, very cool. Thank you so much. It's beautiful. Cool stuff. Wow. Thank you so much. I love it. I love everything, the design and everything. Wow. Oh, oh that is God. beautiful. Wow. This is so fancy. Just the mug and coasters. Wow. Nice. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. That's all that matches the bag, huh? Yeah. Totally. Can touch it? That wow. is so cool. Thank you, Roxanne. Isn't that cool? That's, that's really cool. Wow. Wow, I love the shape of it. 
Yeah. It's amazing. We got the Nescafe Blend 43. I love oh. this stuff. Thank you so much. Yes. I, I always am, uh, always say yes to coffee. And I make it. <gasps> and then in here. Is that for Emma? Oh my cross gosh, Emma, look. Whoa, look at that. Oh, Everything so you need to make your own kangaroo cross stitch creation. Oh my gosh, it's, Emma. It's kangaroo with like a red rock, like Uluru. That style. is beautiful. Oh. Look at that. Look, Emma, come a over here. Set? It's got a Whoa, Emma. Let me see you, there. baby. You can color. <gasps> Look at that, Emma. Wow. See the marker? Yeah. Hey. Thank you so That's much. Cool. Cool. Okay, wow. this is this is for Thank Emma so and much. Andrew as well. This was marked. Okay. We have an Australian wildlife after dark. Whoa. It's like discovery books. Uh -huh. We have life in the sky. Baby animals. Oh, they're gonna love that one. Right. Urban wildlife in your backyard. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and reptiles. Wow. How cool is that? And Australia's most dangerous. Ooh. Ooh. These are books, all Andrew. books for you. Say thank you, Roxanne. Ooh, rock art of the Kimberley. This is the most epic. What is it? One of the most epic regions ever. The Kimberley. Wow, it's beautiful. Western Australia, just beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Very, very cool. Wow. Very cool. That's beautiful. That's nice. Wow. Okay, then we have some Aussie CDs. We have Men at Work. Remember, they're Australian. Yeah. If anyone didn't know. Oh, is that right? Men at Work's Australian, yeah. I've heard on very the comments. Very cool. And then we have, oh, John Farnham, greatest hits. I've never reacted to him on the channel before. People have asked like a million times, but I have seen him in my own time before, mm -hmm. like off camera. He does sound like literally unreal, like epic. Wow. He has like a crazy voice. I have to listen to him. Yeah, you do. It's, it's really cool. So uh, that's that's neat. Thank you, Roxanne. Thank you, Roxanne. Thank you, Roxanne. And we have another package mark for Emma and Andrew. And just playing with a Lego oh, set. Nice. So, Emma oh man, it. these are so exciting, Roxanne. What did you get, Emma? The kids absolutely love oh, stuff from you. I'm not gosh. kidding. Thank Look you, at these Roxanne. animal sets. Part of the brick farm. Oh, oh okay. okay. They're going to have so much fun. Yeah. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Yeah, cool. Look, what what do you got, bud? A copperhead? Nice. Whoa. We have a new flag. We have the kangaroo flag. I love yeah. it. It's a bit of boxing oh, cool. gloves. You see that? Oh, hey, nice. thank you. Oh, that's cool. I'm putting yeah. it in their bedroom. Very very cool. Thank you. I wish it was that big. That looks like a big one. Huh? Oh look, this says Emma and Andrew. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my gosh, you guys. Yes, it does. Andrew, put the tape book here. Show me where you're reading. Show me where you're reading. Yeah. Look. <gasps> Andrew saw this snake in oh the book. Oh, my goodness. Uh -oh. Roxanne hooked you guys up. This is a whole bag full of collectibles here. <gasps> Look. Oh, my God. Coles and Woolies, both. Are you serious? Like little toys? Yeah. Oh, wow. Just like, like heaps wow. of them. Oh, wow. Wow. You guys are lucky. You guys are so lucky. Thank you Roxanne, so much, Roxanne. You are a rock star. Thank you, Roxanne. Oh my God. Yeah. Um, this is for Pedro, which oh he's not God. here right now. Do you no. want to open that for him? Sure, I'll open it and then we can open it for him and then we'll give it yeah. to him because he's out of town right now. <laughs> yeah, Pedro's out of town right now. Uh, I do apologize for that, but we will make sure he sees yes. this. All right, we'll make sure he gets it when he gets back. Yeah, but he'll see it on the video, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's see what he's got. Look at that. That is neat. Wow. Some that's bling, a nice right? Teaching. Yes. <laughs> that's very cool. Nice. Whoa. Right. Very cool. Wow. Thank you, Roxanne, so much. He's gonna love it. Aw. Thank you. Nice. And then Pedro's got himself a new oh. shirt. Are you serious? Wow. Oh my gosh. That's sharp. Wow. Thank you so much, Roxanne. Dang, that's cool. Yes. Oh my gosh. That's so sweet. Thank you. Is that for okay, so go move? ahead. You can show them off. I got these. We have, what is this? Kelly Real Estate. That's kind of cool. Kelly Real Estate bag. Okay. We have Lori. Easter bags here from Kohl's. These are really big. So, okay. so if you're looking for a house, you can talk to that person. There you go. Oh, these are cool carrots. These are cool carrot bags. Yeah. Use this for the uh, grocery store, right? And yes. Easter, of course. Wow. Nice. Very That's nice. So we have a Kohl's, Kohl's magazine for good measure, right? 
Thank you. Both the bags as well as woolies. <laughs> See what's on sale today. Right. What's on sale at the Coles, huh? Yes. And then, ooh, what is this? Umbrella? Are you is serious? It? <gasps> it is. Oh wow. my God, let me see the design on it. It's little roses. Wow. Look at that. Oh. It's little poppies. Yes, you're right. Oh, Sorry cool, about that. right? Yes. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. It's a beautiful oh, my color. Here. Wow. This, Thank you so much, oh, Roxanne. Okay. For everything. This is amazing. All the times that you wow. sell us stuff. Thank you so much. Okay, so then, wow, this is a really heavy book. I love big, heavy books, though. We have Explore Australia 2022. Look at that. Oh. I mean, yeah. That's a, yeah, that's a, <laughs> I'd say they got it covered, huh? We have every town you can think of, even uh, Kenilworth with only 238 people. <laughs> that is crazy. Oh, and of course, these are each state. So, like, this is Northern Territory and the Orange. This is Western Australia and the Purple. South Australia. Oh, look at South Australia. Damn. Look at that. Oh, my God. Whoa, that's cool. South Australia is cool, isn't it? Oh, my gosh. There's a lot of mountains and caves. Yeah, dude. Oh, my gosh. I love the vibe in SA. Then we have AFL. Footy Feud, oh the my Fun gosh. Fest AFL game. That's pretty nice. cool, like a little AFL card game. We should play yeah. that, Ian. Very neat, yeah. <laughs> See how much you know about footy. Yeah. That's cool. Dude, we have to play the game. Some some footy cards. So this is endorsed by Teacher Develops Numeracy? Really? Oh, wow. That's cool. All right, now we have Australian Geographic Explorers Bumper Aussie Quiz Activity, Stuff with Activities book. Oh my god. That's cool, right? Activity book. Yeah, Andrew likes these ones. These are going to be good for the kids. Yes. yes. Thank you so much, Roxanne. <laughs> we have the Aussie alphabet, too. <laughs> oh my god. That's <laughs> ABC. Nice, yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. They're going to learn that before they learn their regular English. And one. then we have Summer Blue, illustrated by uh, Marjorie. Marjorie Crosby Andrew. Farrell. Wow. And Trudy Truman. Thank you. That's a beautiful Very book. Very nice. Very nice books. Thank you so much. Very Thank nice. you, Roxanne. All right, and this is Ruth Stark and Robert Hannaford, My Galopoli. Look at that. Wow. This is the last item in the box. Wow. That's very, cool very cool. Very interesting illustrations. Wow. Very interesting. Um, I'm going to read that for sure. Thank you guys. Thank, Thank you, guys you so, so much, much for uh, everything. Roxanne, yeah. You are incredible. Um, Large. Wow, there's even this. Stickers. Oh, stickers? We're stuck to this in the receipt too, but. So this should be the last stickers. thing. Yes. So. I, I am just blown away. Roxanne, you are literally like, <laughs> a, a, like a, a part of this channel, you know? Like yeah. you are an all-star. Yeah. Time and effort. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. It's always well done. It's personalized. It's yeah. thoughtful. You always deliver, so thank you so much. Yes, yeah, thank you and to everybody. And this is the sticker, Wilderness Society, Everyone Needs Trees. Aww. <laughs> Very cool. That's so cute. I want a mic card. <laughs> Another great episode. Multiple countries, multiple awesome people. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you to thank everybody you. so thank much. You, thank you, thank you. Thank you. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Next week, guys. Right? See ya. Thank bye -bye. you. Bye. bye.